The angle of elevation of the sun is 35.1 degrees at the instant the shadow cast by the Washington Monument is 789 feet long. Use this information to calculate the height of the monument. The angle of elevation, let's talk about that real quick. So if I have an angle theta of elevation, elevation means that you're going up. So the angle would be near the bottom. As opposed to an angle of depression, that would be an angle that's moving down. So we have an angle of elevation of the sun. So let's have our Washington Monument. I'm no artist by any means here, so let's say that's the Washington Monument. So then the sun uh, is behind it. So it's casting a shadow that's 789 feet long. Okay, the angle of elevation of the sun. So we have two possible choices here. So the sun is shining, so it's either the top one or the bottom one. Since we're talking about elevation, it's going to be the bottom one because it's going up. So the angle of elevation is 35.1 degrees. So we want to find the height of the monument, so let me call that x. Okay, so using the fact that hopefully um, the monument and the ground is perpendicular, we have a right triangle. So let's figure out which trig function will relate the opposite with the adjacent. That's our tangent. So the tangent of 35.1 degrees is opposite over adjacent. So solving for x, and we had the shadow being in feet, so this would also be in feet. Now this is our exact answer, but if you're looking for an approximation, we'll just go to the calculator. Make sure you got degree mode. So 789 times the tangent of 35.1. So about 554.52 feet.